Booth's been taking Jared out of trouble since they were kids. Jared always comes up smelling like a rose, and Booth takes the hit. He's denied his brother the opportunity to take responsibility and learn from his own mistakes. You have no evidence of that. I've known the Booth boys for 15 years. No, it, it's natural to be protective of a younger sibling. Of course, Jared is a grown man. An intelligent, talented, capable... Oh, what? I like him very much. Yeah, well, I'll cut it out. What? I shouldn't be talking about the fact yeah. that his brother is more successful. I am absolutely certain <laughs> however it is, Booth lost all the credit for that week of us. It's because of Jared. We're all scientists here, right? Well, not you. What is your evidence? How about this? The last time I told Booth what I thought of Jared, he didn't speak to me for six months. They are way too big for their baby puppy pen, by the way. <laughs> but it's cooler in here than it is out there, so. I am comfortable with evidence. It's Treasure and Kirby and Titus playing with the toy. Which suggests they were killed by the same person. Thank you. Should I tell this? No, I'll do it. All right, Brad. Hey. Yes, what a beautiful woman asked me out for lunch. Something wrong? I need to know. I've heard that about you. Do you know anything about... So we're going to chill out under the fan for a little bit here.